Okay, this is Dave Vellante, and we're here at the Hack Reduce uh, event. We're here with Governor Deval Patrick. Governor, thanks for taking some time with us. Glad to. Thank you, Dave. Now, you were talking about your, uh, in your remarks about Tuesday. That's what they call Super Tuesday for you, isn't it? <laughs> Pretty exciting, yeah. Yeah, yeah so congratulations yeah. on Thank that, you. and uh, we're really looking forward to bringing the, both sides of the aisles together and working on our problems, and I know you've been a big part of that and a big supporter of that. Well, you know, the whole, the whole challenge and opportunity of big data is nonpartisan, right? It's about, uh, it's about taking all this data out there and turning it into useful information, and the more useful information we have, in my view, uh, the, the wiser our decisions will be, whether they are public policy decisions or commercial decisions. When did the light go off in your head around big data where you said, Hey, this sounds like it feels like it's going to be important. Well, we have a, a great concentration of, of tech talent here in, uh, in the greater Boston area and in Massachusetts generally. Um, but when you consider where the, what's new, uh, you know, cybersecurity, big data, uh, robotics, uh, for example, we play in some, but not all of those areas. And we ought to play in all of them. Uh, and big data was, a, was an opportunity just waiting to be uh, seized. When you think about life sciences, obviously Boston has a good mojo around life right. sciences. Right. Do you see the intersection of life sciences and big data as really bringing back a lot of that uh, uh, excellence to Boston and really helping catapult this region? Well, we are probably the preeminent uh, life sciences supercluster in the world right now. But some of the work that is done by our companies and researchers here in uh, analyzing large amounts of data is done elsewhere. But we have the capability here. What we don't have is the expertise. And so building that expertise is what HackReduce is about. And, uh, and it's a really exciting initiative. Well, I really appreciate your support with HackReduce. Uh, do you see the point you know, down the road where the state actually will, will fund initiatives like this? Or is that something that you just stay out of? Well, we do, you know, you can't have a, a, a state that can expect to, you know, substitute for the private market. It's really important that there are investors here and folks from, uh, uh, from the, uh, from the um, uh, private equity and uh, venture capital community. But we will do our part, and sometimes in helping uh, a new initiative get over that, uh, that valley of death, as investors sometimes describe it, something we've done in other areas, and we might well be able to do it here as well. So i got to ask you, last question, you're in your prime. What's next for Deval Patrick? Well, I got two more years to be governor here, and I'm going to do the very best I can to make the most of that time for the people of Massachusetts. And after that, we'll see. Probably back in the private sector. Hey, thanks very much for spending some time with us, Governor. I really yeah. appreciate it. Thank you very much. Take Good care. to see you.